All right. Sorry about that, everybody. I hung up the wrong phone. <laughs> I do that sometimes. I didn't... Mike, everybody, I didn't mean to hang up on you guys. I didn't mean to turn off the live feed. I hung up the wrong phone. So, once again, we're calling my people that love me the most, which are the scammers. The ones over in India and Pakistan from these call centers that they, they miss me, I think. So, sorry about that. I hung up the wrong phone when I do it. Sometimes that happens. All right, here we go. Aww. You have reached has been disconnected or is no longer in service. These are, it's why I thought they loved me. I guess they, when I didn't answer them or I didn't take their call, they hurried up and disconnected me from their scam. Well, so let's try this one. Maybe this one will be home. Maybe this one will do better. I'm sorry. The person trying to reach has a voicemail. See what happens when you don't take scam calls? I think I heard all the feelings. On this Valentine's Day, I heard all the feelings of my scammers, the ones that try to scam me, the ones that take advantage of me. You know, I, I know a couple days ago I heard somebody that had stolen Valor and we found out about it and, oh, he don't like it one bit, yet he's got army tags all over his vehicles and everything. He didn't like that either. I'm just sad that they don't they don't like my sarcasm. So So we'll try, okay. So how about this one? Let's try again, okay? Let, let's try again. Oops, got person. You have reached a number that is no longer. Aww. Please check the number. I'm sorry, everybody. I thought they'd be my Valentine tonight. <laughs> oh, it's pathetic that they don't even keep. They realize the numbers they call. Uh, a couple of those numbers I cannot put on there. It's just funny, is all. And I apologize, everybody. We'll do it as one. There you go. Oh, wait a minute. We got. I'm sorry, the number you have reached is not in service. Please check the number. No. Anyway, everybody, I just want to have a little fun tonight on Valentine's Day. Gracie's with me tonight. Hope everybody's having a great day. Call up your loved ones. Tell them you love them. Tell them you care about them. Say hi to them. Um, actually, let's just can I talk about something serious real quick? Temperature's supposed to get down to negative five tonight. Make sure your parents, their neighbors, everybody, make sure their furnaces and everything are okay. Make sure to go out of your way to make sure, because like I said, negative five is no joke when it comes to that temperature, okay? For all you truckers on the road tonight, we appreciate you guys. We know you guys are out there in this na nasty weather and everything, and we appreciate what you do. But seriously, call up people. Make sure their heaters and everything are all right. Make sure they're not cold. You know, it's kind of like in the, in, the, in the summertime when it, it gets above 100 degrees. And people, you know, that's not good on anybody. Um, don't let your animals outside in this crap, okay? Seriously, if you have animals and stuff, bring them in. You know what? That's, uh, you know, animal abuse, and you don't want to do that, all right? Dogs cannot be out in this, okay? I know you all think, oh, they're fine outside sleeping in the pond that's frozen over with ice. No, they're not, okay? So make sure to get your animals and everything inside. Make sure you guys call your loved ones. It is Valentine's Day. Make sure you're doing something fun with your kids. I'm going to get over here with Gracie here real quick and do something fun with her. I got Kimmy Gibbler over tonight. Kimmy Gibbler! Anyway, she's over tonight, too. Anybody want to meet Kimmy Gibbler? What? Come here, Kimmy. They want to meet you. That, that's Kimmy Gibbler, and that's Gracie. Quick, kicking Kimmy Gibbler in the butt. Yeah, we get home and the neighbor's like, oh, Gracie's there. She's like got a radar on. She got like a radar on. What are you two doing? Anyway, they're being silly. Anyway, hope you all have a great day. Appreciate y'all. Y'all matter. I'll talk with everybody soon. I'm going to get back. Have a very good, uh, happy Valentine's Day. Craig Mudd, your mom doing okay? Hope she's doing okay, buddy. Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Mike, are you on the road? Tina Earhart, hope you're doing great. Tell everybody in your family I said hi. Karen, tell everybody I said hi. Why are you in my face? Why are you here? Why are you here? Oh, my goodness. Bye-bye. That's right. I'm like that dog that barks at them when they come at me. <laughs> anyway, I'll talk to everybody later. Have a good one. Hey, Mike, be careful out there on the road, okay?
No, no, it says five on the thing right now. It actually says it's supposed to get down to five again tonight. Good, I'm glad she's better. Yeah, I know it was negative five last night, too. Right now, it is dropped to... I will tell you what it's dropped to. All right. Yep, that's right. I got a scared. It's 10 degrees outside right now, and that means it dropped five more degrees in the last hour. Because when I got in here uh, 30 minutes ago, it was 17 when I picked up Gracie. Dropped to 15 when I was over at Casey's. And now, as you can see, it is 10 degrees outside. I don't know why it's on that. I got that up a little high. So it's supposed to get down to 5 again tonight. And it probably will, too. So, all right, everybody. You guys, and like I said, just in case you're wanting to know, yes, the Carolina Reapers are doing good. Nobody from uh, Wingfest called me this year for the hottest pepper stuff. I think it just really hurt everything last year. But you can all see they're getting really, really big. Remember, this guy's way above there now. So he's big. I got to start bringing up the lights a little bit. This guy started, I think, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with him. Uh, but he dried out really quick, and I don't know why, but I'll figure it out. So, all right, guys, talk to you later.